do you see our preps going? Um, given the majority of the lads, a few run outs, two or three games each, uh, so everyone should be should be pretty up to speed with their with their 2020 game. Um, and hopefully the weather stays good for tomorrow, and, and we see see how we go. Anything stand out from the last sort of three days? Anyone in particular, or just a good good squad performances? Yeah, everyone everyone through the week uh, through the week has performed at different levels. Uh, so yesterday, Coe got 60 odd Housey battered well and Muchy um, before that there have been some good bowling performances Paney Paney and Matty Taylor um, and yeah all the lads have chipped in so we've tried to give everyone an opportunity to, to get a bit of a practice with a bat on the ball um, Just regarding sort of prep this year we look to try and do anything sort of new or different or you know has it, has it just been sort of going back to our T20 schools or we try to adopt some sort of different strategies or anything new that you know uh, that can help us forward Talked to a lot of the bowlers just been better than they were last year, so that's adding uh, more skills to the game. So obviously we've had Ian Harvey and working with him and trying to add a extra one or two deliveries to each bowler. Um, and batting wise, similar, just adding a few more shots. So hopefully we'll be a better team um, collectively and individually than we were last year. Lovely. Look, uh, going into sort of tomorrow night. Hopefully, you know our style of campaign. How do you think the lads are feeling? Any sort of vibes kicking about at the moment in nets or? You know, is it just sort of another game sort of coming up? Uh, like I said, we've done all the prep for the for the game. Um, it's now down to to each lad just to nail their role and, and look after their own game, really. So if we do that, I'm, I'm pretty confident we'll go well. Magic. Thank you for that, mate. Cheers. Yeah.